Hello Internet, I am the final boss and today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. Today I'm going to be unboxing an Xbox One S. This is the one terabyte version. It just came out uh, yesterday as of this video, I hope. So let's go ahead and get to it. Uh, forgive me, this is the first time I've ever done an unboxing. It probably isn't going to be that good. But I haven't seen anybody really do an unboxing of Xbox One S's. Uh, let's see, what's this? Oh man, it's a nice little guy telling you how to turn things on. I think, I think I'll be fine, personally. Now let's go ahead and start pulling some things out. Ooh, is this upside down? I need to flip it over. Off to a great start. All right, let's start with this. What is in here? Ah, this is actually the Madden version of the Xbox One S. I don't have Madden in it because I sold it off as soon as I got it because I'm not a big sports game fan. But because of that, it came with one month of EA Access. It came with uh, some DLC for Madden 2017. 20% off of the NFL Sports Shop, that's neat. And obviously, like most things, it comes with a 14 day, 7 day free trial of Xbox Live Gold, which I would obviously recommend if you don't have it. That seems to be all that is in this little, this little packet. Let's go ahead and start pulling some more things out. This is probably just power stuff. Probably nothing special. Let me see. Yeah, here's the uh, power cable. We got ourselves a nice little HDMI cable. Thankfully, those are provided. I have, I'm kidding. Actually, I have like a million of them. We got ourselves, this is probably one of the coolest things for those of you who don't already have an Elite controller. This is a very light uh, controller. It's got some grips on the sides. I don't think you can probably see that from here. Here, let me go ahead and bring that up to you. It's got some grips. Oh, you can't really see it anyway. But it's got the grips, it's got regular everything else. I'm probably not going to use this as much as I'd use my actual uh, Xbox One Elite controller. I like that one. But this does have the little audio jack so you can plug in any pair of headphones you want. It looks like Microsoft's, Microsoft's even nice enough to give you two AA batteries. Got all this in this box? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Now it's time to go ahead and get out what you guys came here for. The bread and butter, the Xbox One S. Which, well god damn it, it's still upside down. I try so hard to make sure this didn't come out upside down. And look what happens to me. It's like a bad version of Christmas. Except everything's hard to unwrap. And I, well I guess that's just like regular Christmas. Ooh hoo hoo, looky here. Doesn't this look nice? Oh, the things in the back are nicely labeled. I like that. Uh, you couldn't really tell as easily what was going on with the original Xbox One. I have the day one edition, or had. I traded it up for this one. And it was, because of the black, it was black on gray, and it was kind of hard to read sometimes. But here in the back, you can see with the white on gray, it all looks nice to read and everything. And, oh yeah, right here, you know what the best part about this is? The power brick is inside of this bag. This, this really tiny little thing. You remember, I'm sure you guys have seen an Xbox One at this point. It's been out for like three years, but look at this. It's so tiny. Ooh, ooh, I like this right here. You got a USB in the front now. That always really uh, grind my gears whenever I had to plug it into the side. And it was, it never really worked out. And then, the physical button to eject and a physical button in order, wait, is that a physical button? Ooh, yes it is, you can hear that. I probably shouldn't just spam touching the button. The IR blaster is built in so you don't need to connect anymore, which is obviously a pretty good selling point for most people. Connects kind of suck. If you've watched my previous two streams, the audio is garbage. That's because I'm using a connect. From here on out, I'm gonna be using a headset, and maybe even, I may even try and use my mic on it. 
I've seen a few people uh, show me how to do that. But this has been unboxing the Xbox One S. I hope you like it. I do not plan on doing too many unboxings in the future unless I have something really cool, like maybe a special edition game or another game console. We'll, uh, we'll see about that though in the future. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.